Hi there, everyone. Here is me this morning at CrossFit. One of my favorite ways to start the day is with a good workout. And I've never been good at just going to the gym and doing my own workout. Uh, I usually end up looking at my phone or just talking to random people. So I love CrossFit because I just show up, do the workout, and I'm done. And I feel like it's changed the shape of my body too. And welcome back to my channel. It's Carol here and I'm back with a what I eat in a day video. This is where I show you how easy it is to eat a whole food plant-based diet, even on a busy schedule. If you've been following me, you know that I did a potato reset for five days last week. And I've been coming off of that and noticing some things about the potato reset. One thing I've noticed is that I'm craving veggies like crazy. I'm not sure why. They just taste extra amazing to me. I went to CrossFit this morning, had a great workout, and now I am ready for a big salad. This is half a cucumber in here, a bunch of tomatoes, a whole shredded carrot, and some romaine, some green onions, and some uh, bell peppers in here. I love starting my day with vegetables. I love eating vegetables when I'm really hungry. They taste amazing and they just fuel me throughout my day. I need to take the kids to school pretty soon, so I'm going to get, th get through as much of this as I can. This is part of the salad that I prepped the other day, so I still have some of that left, and that is awesome to have on hand when you are too busy to cook. So it's about 11 o'clock, and I'm just gonna go ahead and eat this. I've got some of my potato ranch. I've been missing my potato ranch because it does have a little bit of tofu in it. So I haven't been eating that through my potato reset, so it tastes extra good to me now. And I find that this combination, the dressing has a potato and a half a block of tofu in it. It lasts me for a few days, but it the combination of these ingredients keeps me full for hours. So I, I do have my soup though, if I get hungry later, which I, I might or I might not, Every day is different with me. I don't know about you guys, but I really love having a big salad and it tastes so good when you're really hungry, especially after a workout. So I will catch up with you guys later. It's 1.30 and we need to leave here in about five minutes to go to the DMV. Child number two is getting his taking his driver's test again. So fingers crossed, we have one licensed driver in the house. Hopefully this will be my last trip to the DMV for a long time, but if not, whatever. I am starting to get hungry. I'm needing some starch. So I have my veggies that I already prepped two days ago and my oil-free hummus. This is so good. I'm so glad to have it because I got the munchies and we'll probably be gone only an hour or two, but I'm starting to get a little hungry and this really hits the spot. I bought these ornaments at Target. It says, always remember 2022. I thought they were cute for John's mom and his sister. And I just found some cute pictures to put inside. This is John and his sister and her firstborn. Coral is her name. She's 19 now. And this is another one of John and his sister. And here is one of John and his beautiful mother. This was many years ago and John, his mom, and his sister. So I'm just gonna cut out what I, I'm gonna see which ones will fit and put them in there and send that to them as part of their Christmas gift. I thought they were cute. And they're kind of Christmassy, but you could kind of keep it up year round if you had a special place he wanted to look at that. And you can change the picture anytime you want to, which I thought was cute. So anyway, that's what I've been doing is digging through pictures for the last hour and a half going down memory lane. <sighs> I'm excited to go to the DMV. Hopefully we get some good news today. Mm. I'm back, I'm hungry. It's 6 p.m. I went out and did a little bit of Christmas shopping while the boys were at track and field practice. I got some good stuff. I got some stocking stuffers and um, a few things for some last minute gifts. So I'm feeling good about that. I am snacking on my scrap soup. I'm actually not snacking on it. This bowl was completely full and it's the perfect like preloading for before my dinner because I don't have any dinner prepped. I'm gonna start working on that now. This soup is so delicious. If you saw me make it yesterday, it's mostly the ends of the veggies that are still edible. Um, things that you wouldn't normally eat, probably like kale stems and the tops and the, the greens and the middle of the celery, things like that. I 
keep them in a freezer bag and when it's full I make this scrap soup and I put three gold potatoes in it and an onion and some carrots and that kind of uh, makes it a little bit creamy. I puree it of course because the kale stems can be hard to eat but they give it a delicious flavor and it's really delicious. I'm really enjoying it. I'm so glad I have it because I was hungry and I don't even have a potato cooked or anything so I am going to think for a minute about what I want to prepare and this is going to help me think once I get some food in me. So yummy. Mm. And filling. This is full of fiber. So this is going to fill me up for the next couple hours. I have the time now that I'm home to make something. I want to make a large quantity of something so that I'll have it for tomorrow as well. Okay, that soup was very filling, but I made a huge pot of veggies and beans. This is... Um, cannellini beans, three zucchinis, uh, Brussels sprouts, uh, a few handfuls of baby spinach, and some sweet corn. And I just cooked it with some garlic salt and fresh ground pepper. And I have a big hunk of sweet potato here. Mm. Mm, so good and so filling. I've missed beans. I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. I have a, a bunch more for tomorrow. I have this leftover for tomorrow. You know, I love to eat veggies just cold out of the fridge. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. I may have more. I have more, the other half of the sweet potato and tons more veggies, but I will let you know if I do. Okay, that was delicious. I ended up having another big bowl of just the veggies and beans, but I still have some leftover for tomorrow. This is gonna be perfect. And I have half of that sweet potato leftover. I am absolutely stuffed, so I'm going to quit for the night, and I will see you guys tomorrow.